So, what does a day-to-day -day of the life of the meteorologist look like? So, um, I'm the meteorologist in charge of the National Weather Service office in Boulder. The public sees almost all the work that we do in the public forecast and when we issue warnings or watches, when we have a wildfire and then the aftermath of that is the burned area is really hydrophobic and has a really dramatic response to any rainfall and we can have flash flooding and debris flow. So that's an area that we've done a lot of work in to prep our team in the office and the meteorologists to issue warnings, but also to educate the public about the threats from those things. So what about you, Cody? What are you working on here at Lockheed Martin? Um, I'm a GOES technician senior. Um, what that entails and looks like is basically more of the mechanical side of things. So the the hands-on, you know, installing instruments, uh, doing wire harnesses. We have to keep track of a large list of things that is either going to go on the satellite now, later, or maybe sometimes never. To me, it seems like you must have to be really detail-oriented and really precise and really careful with everything that you do over there. Yes, yeah, so everything is very specific to detail. Um, you have to follow it 100%. You know, it has to be done this way. So for the everyday person, how does the importance of your job impact them? I think what sets the weather service apart is the fact that we have experienced people working in every single office around the clock, monitoring the latest observations coming in from satellite, radar, the latest model data that's coming in. To me, I think that's the piece of the job that I love the most is that you know we're there to serve and we're serving the public. Do you see a connection between what you do every day here at Lockheed Martin with how that impacts the public? It's awesome um, being able to say that, you know, you work on stuff that everybody relies on every day. It, it's just a great feeling to know, I mean, that you've personally put something on a satellite that's in space that not everybody in an everyday life can say.